friends, it's Ray. Thank you so much for joining me today. Today I'm going to do a quick unboxing of the May 2021 Hero Arts Monthly Card Kit. And the theme for this kit is underwater, um, salty water, uh, so water scenes, ocean scenes, water scenes. And the kit features a 6x8 clear stamp set and coordinating frame cuts. Let's take a look here. I guess I'll leave that there. So here is the stamp set. We've got this huge sea anemone coral looking stamp. Um, and uh, lots of fish, some clown fish. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six sentiments, a jellyfish, starfish, seahorse, um, more coral, and oh gosh, I don't know what kind of fish these are, uh, but I will try and use those. And then some bubbles. And then, oh, let's move this. This looks a little better. I hope you can see that a little better. Okay, so we also have frame cuts for just about every image. Of course, this large image. And then I didn't put these on a magnet yet. So let me see if I can match them up. That fish, the starfish, uh, it's like a large coral or some kind of sea plant, or jellyfish, and that reminds me of last year's kit. We got a jellyfish. I might have to look that up. Haven't done that. Let me move this up some. So this fish. This clam shell, the little clownfish, did you see that? And then this fish here with the black stripes. Um, let's see, our seahorse. And this fish, wow, and this must be the big clownfish, yep. So we've got this dies for every image in the set except the bubbles. Okay. Let's move this. We also got a couple of ink cubes. We got the contour ink. Get that out of there. And the intensified black ink. And I have the intense black ink. So I think this is my first time getting the intensified, and that's supposed to be even darker and more crisp than the intense black ink. And then this contour ink, I believe this is new, and this is supposed to, you can use this to do a light stamping so that you can do a no-line water or no-line um, watercolor coloring or no-line marker coloring. And then we got this uh, pretty underwater embossing powder. It says shake well. Uh, what happened? I was I had a scrap piece of paper out. Here it is, so that we can take a look at this embossing powder, or a closer look, I should say. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's really pretty. So it's got some sparkles and looks like a little bit of white and some turquoise and some other glittery, sparkly things. Okay, and then we also got two sheets of rose quartz paper. Let's see, I think it's these. And that is a pearlescent type. Um, it feels like a matte, but it's got a sheen shine to it. So we got two of those. 
eight and a half by five and a half. And then we've got the pearlescent cardstock, the quartz pearlescent. Oh, pretty, pretty. I don't know if you can, if the camera will pick that up, but that's really pretty. And then we got two, no, three quartz, nope, white frost cardstock and with brocade texture. Oh, I see. So yeah, it is really textured. And see, hopefully the light, camera light will pick that up. It's got um, horizontal lines, textured lines. Really pretty. Ooh, nice. And let's see. I think I got everything. Yes. Yeah, so that's it for the kit. Can't wait to get started using this and uh, making some of these really pretty coral sea anemone type images and fish using, of course, the images from the kit. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining me. Uh, I will be back soon with cards that I make using this kit. So uh, if you haven't uh, subscribed to my channel and want to see more, please subscribe. And uh, that way, once I upload my video with cards from this kit, you will be the first to know. As always, thank you so much for joining me today. Until next time, good day, friends.